Hey there guys, I'm Miguel Sanchez. Welcome to episode 434 of Moshi Monster Fire Feet. And before we begin though, we have three new subscribers to the channel as we be as we continue the road to 1,000 subscribers. That's right, I have three new subscribers to the channel that we need to welcome aboard. Welcome to the channel, Alexander Leah! Oh my gosh, that's right. Alexander Leah, you are the new subscriber to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. Please go check out his channel. I'll leave a link to it on the top right corner of the screen. If I can't find it, leave it in the description below. We're on our way to 1,000 subscribers, so thank you for subscribing, Alexander Leah. You're the best. Second subscriber today, Princess Madison 2008. Yay! That's right, Princess Madison 2008. A new subscriber. You subscribe to my channel, so thank you for subscribing. The road to 1,000 subscribers continues, continues. Please go check out her channel. I'll put a link up there on the top right corner of the screen, but if you can't find it, I'll leave it in the description below. So, once again, thank you, Princess Madison 2008. You're the best. And one final reminder, and one final subscriber to the channel. Welcome to the channel. Check, like, DVD, and Blu-ray. That's right, Jack Light DVD Blu ray. You are the new subscriber to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. We're on our way to 1,000 subscribers, so thank you so much. You are the best. Please go check out his channel. The link will be on the top right corner of the screen. If I can't find it, I'll leave the description below. Thank you for subscribing, Jack Light DVD Blu ray. You are the best. We really love you. Couldn't have done it without you. Thank you for your support. All right, no talk. I want to thank, I want, thanks again to Alexander Leah, Princess Madison 2008, and Jack Light DVD Blu ray for subscribing to my channel. We're on the road to 1,000 subscribers, so thank you for subscribing. You're the best. All right, now talk back to the video. We've got another monster to take a look at as we close out the lucky set. That's right, the lucky set ends today, people. We started the set with we started the set with Fernando the Mystic Boggy on episode 142. Then we took a look at 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 Jackpot, the Jackpot, the Lucky Hoopty Doo, which I don't know if I'm right. Uh, who cares? On episode 192, that's the Super Monster that I said. Then we took a look at O'Reilly, the Unlucky Larrikin, which I'm saying right, on episode 280, and then most recently, Penny, the Mini Money, on episode 296. Now it's time to close out this set once and for all with the final Monster that I said. Are you ready for it? So am I. It's game time, people. It's happening right here, right now. Are you ready for it? Then let's get started. Welcome to episode 434. Today is about Tingling, the Kinnon of Good Fortune. Man, I'm so excited to be proud of part of this. We we finally get to close it up. This set was and for all for those who have seen episode four hundred thirty three. It was about Tiki, the pilfering toucan out of the birdie set. Please go check it right, right now. I'll put a link up there on the top recorder screen so you can check check right now. He is the final main monster in the birdie set. Before we get to the super monster, Tuco the garish flamingo, which I'll talk about episode four hundred forty two. So stay tuned for that. Let's see. We we'll don't get to on episode four hundred forty eight. So stay tuned for that as well. I don't know which episode number it is, but but you get the point. But anyways, enough talk. Let's get right to the episode, shall we? Are you ready? Good. Then let's get started. All right. So who is Tingling? Tingling, the king of for good fortune, is a monster in the lucky set. They are based on the mani uh, the maniki deco, a a Japanese lucky charm. Tingling has a magical bell, that, and they are rumored to bring good luck. Tingling makes their debut in season two, mission five, the curse of the pearl waving kin, in which she was locked up by the Maroon Five, and as a result was brought. Bad luck it said. At least that's what the Maroon 5 claimed. I didn't know Tingling is a female, huh? Tingling is a female machine. How could you? How could she do that? But yes, take a look at her stats here. Her name is Tingling. Says Lucky's machine number 063. 063? That's what it says here. Species is kin of kin group fortune. Rarity is uncommon. Release on July 12, 2012. Figures in series 2. I know, friends. Machine combination to catch. The machine combination to catch her. You're going to release the Roshi Mission Season 2, Mission 5, The Curse of the Paul A. the Kin, as I mentioned before. Now I'll do overall Miguel Sanchez extra version of my second channel, so keep your eyes for before coming soon. I'll leave a link to my to my second channel in the description below. So please go subscribe to my second channel. If you haven't done so yet, please go do it right now. Moving on to the biography. Good fortune befalls any monster who stumbles upon a kid of good fortune, particularly if it, it's its magic neck bell is tinkling. I first came across one of these incredibly cute little monsterings while dining in a restaurant on Hong Kong Island in the middle of Potion Ocean. I'm not sure if its mystical powers had any effect, but I do remember finding a pile of rocks in my rucksack shortly afterwards. So who knows? Reverence a wave if you see one, because these mystic monsterings can spread joy and happiness with just one wave of the paw. <laughs> Yay, I know. No baby bio, good fortune befalls any monsters who stumbles upon a kid in a good fortune, particularly if its magic neck bell is tingling. Roar to wave if you see one because these mystic monsterings can spread joy and happiness with just one wave of the paw. Now you know, my friends. I get them right now. In the character's Wikipedia, Bane, the kind and generous kid of good fortune can be spotted a catnapping on windowsills and rooftops across Monster City. In a Moshi who comes 
across Tingling or the other Fortunate Felines is guaranteed good, especially if their magic bells are tingling. Mystic Boggy, Mystic Boshlings, kiss kitties of good fortune. Uh, and the kitties of good fortune enjoy reading the, f the future in tea leaves and wolving down fortune cookies. These luckies are very friendly balls of fluff, but they don't like journalists prying to the, into their kitty cat business, and they would never ever grant food, grant good fortune, good fortune to to those pesky botchly puppies. Uh oh. I don't know about you, but but they're out there. Oh no. We do not want any of those to come along. Oh, oh no. McNulty, Fifi, White Fang, Scamp. They are the Bosch Link puppies. And for and Frankie is the super boshing and that said. So 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 beware. Alright. Ghost Pirate Pet. Poor Tingling was captured by the ghost pirates of the Gooey Galleon. Then it blamed the when their ship became cursed. Seriously, once the crew released their kitty captive, the bad luck curse was lifted. Yay! <laughs> I didn't know about you, but yeah, yeah, that's all I gotta say. Um, yeah, and uh, check out the Gooey Galleon here on Motion Monster Variety. I talked about it on episode 159, so please go check it out right now if you haven't seen it yet. I recommend you do so. Moving on to the stats, moving on to the day of battle. Mossy type, lucky species, kitten of good fortune. Habitat, Hong Bog Island, lucky friends are Penny, Aureli, and Fernando. <sighs> yes, I know. Um, uh, Penny. Was well, on episode two hundred ninety six. Oh, really? Was on episode two hundred eighty, and Fernando was on, was on episode one hundred forty two. Please go check out these episodes right now. You haven't seen them yet. No for the notes. Kitty, cute kitty girl, magic, tingly bell, and one way of the ball spreads joy and happiness. <laughs> Man, love that. Uh, Indian Petrol Club Perfect Guide. Kittens of good fortune love lying on windmills and rooftops, but indeed, if you do buy one at ground level, then you are fortunate indeed. Good luck will come to anyone who finds a kid a good fortune. Particularly if its magic neck bell is tickling, these mystic boshlings spread delight with and joy wherever they go, with just a wave from one of their paws. Originally from Hotball Island, they enjoy reading tea leaves and feasting on fortune cookies. The only thing they think of as very bad luck is being boshly puppies. Uh oh. Bad puppies, bad! Uh, and Habitat, originally for Hollow Island, Island, kids of good fortune, love relaxing on windowsills and rooftops. In the traits, personality, generous, friendly, wise, likes reading tea leaves and scoffing fortune goodies, dislikes investigative journalists and mochi puppies. Fine with the trivia, it is unclear if kids of good fortune have cursed powers as well. At least Tingling has these powers, according to the Borrowed Five. Ooh, no. Sue, Sui's biography states that. Uh, the, the Sui's biography states she likes the kitten, the kittens of good fortune, so it could be assumed she likes tingling. Mm, I know. Oh, I forgot to tell you, Sui, the uh, Sui, the uh, bashful bullhead. Is she is from the Munchie set? I already talked about her on episode four hundred and five of the series. So haven't seen it yet. Please go watch it right now. I don't to do so. And by the way, and by the way, for those of you who don't know what who the Maroon Five are, they are Captain Coswallop. If we have. McScruff, Mr. Bushy Bees, Hen uh, Handy Van Hoax, and Johnny Jack. If you have been discussed in past episodes of the series, please go watch them right now. You have seen it. But yeah, there, that's the end of Tingling, ladies and gentlemen. Final answer for the character. Told you keep Tingling is a good character. No doubt, it's definitely the best. And I want to say, if you can't handle the truth, just try try, just try to be your best. I love having ha I love having Tingling on board. It's so worth it. It's definitely worth a try. Honestly, what's 10? I'm rating Tingling with a score of 7 out of 10. A good character, very good, good, as in kitten of good fortune. Hence the species there. Tingling link, it's a kitten of good fortune. I'm giving it a good score, 7 out of 10. Nothing more about here, but yeah, that's it, guys. That's all there is to it. Bottom line, period, the end. But yeah, that's one of the personal anchors for DMP. Feel free to agree or disagree with your thoughts and your opinions in the comment section down below. With that, guys, we are done. Thank you for watching another episode of Motion Monster Mario. We hope you guys enjoyed it. Another Moshi set is complete! Yay! <laughs> That's it, my friends. We've we have completed another Moshi set. The lucky set is over. <laughs> Thank you all for tuning in today. Uh, we'll see you tomorrow for Logo History episode four hundred, episode three hundred forty-four, as we take a look at Village Roadshow pictures. So don't miss out on that. And we will see you and and keep your eyes. And guess what? Tomorrow we have a new episode of Movie History Walt Disney Animation Studios. Yay! That's right. Tomorrow we have a new episode of Movie History Walt Disney Animation Studios. Episode twenty-one will be about. Robin Hood, so don't miss out. 
hope you can tune in for that as well. But yes, we'll we have more great content for you tomorrow. And don't forget, Saturday, Logo History of Moshi episode 15. Be on the lookout for that. And, and uh, Logo History Retold, based on the words of Marching 047L. That'll be on Saturday as well. Episode 11 will be about NBC. That's right. It's the National Broadcasting Company. Requested by Icon and Jay. Be on the lookout for that video coming soon. But yeah, that's it, guys. All We're out of time for today. So thanks for tuning in today. I'm going to go such as you yourself. And I will see you tomorrow on Moshi Monsters Biography. Well, can't wait, guys. The, well, here we go, guys. The final Food Factory character here on Moshi Monsters Biography. We're going to be covering that tomorrow. Episode 435 is about Tingle. Please stay tuned for it. The final character for the Food Factory to be covered on the show. We'll be taking... We, it's our way, Dilby on episode 97, that Dweezil on episode 110. I don't know. I don't know about you. And that Gabi on episode 156, that Grot on episode 165. I don't know. I don't know, but yes. But yes, as I expected. And then Milo on episode 253, and then, uh, and then, and then uh, Reggie, which I don't know about you. Uh, on episode 334, and then most recently, and then most recently, Thumpy on episode 429. Now we take a look at the final character from the Foo Fighter 3, Tingle. So stay tuned for it. It's gonna shock you. So get ready, guys. Oh boy, get ready for the ultimate electrocution of a lifetime. So please be warned and stay tuned for episode 435 tomorrow, where it's, where it's about Tingle. So we'll see you there. In the meantime, thanks for watching. I'm Gus Sanchez. Please remember to leave a like, share this video with your friends. Leave a comment down below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Also, turn on notifications to never miss a new video. Or please subscribe to the notification draw to never miss no new video from me as we're on the road to 1,000 subscribers. Uh, Alexander Leah, Princess Medicine 2008, and, uh, and Jack, like DVD and Blu-ray, did it. They all subscribed to my channel and now it's your turn. You must subscribe to the channel right now. So please go do it right now. Otherwise, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you have a fantastic day and we'll see what more good content for you guys tomorrow. I'm Gus Sessions for Motion Monster Brian B. Until next time, thanks for watching. Like, favorite, subscribe. I'll see you in another video. Laters!